So wallpaper can be a great thing for decorating. It can also be a nightmare when it comes to mold. So the one place that I never want to see drywall or wallpaper, excuse me, is on. I'm Cheryl Seiko, avoidingmold.com, and in this video, I'm gonna talk about wallpaper. So wallpaper can be a great thing for decorating. It can also be a nightmare when it comes to mold. So the one place that I never wanna see drywall, or wallpaper, excuse me, is on exterior walls. The reason why is because many of our wallpapers act as a vapor barrier. So they act as a, vape, a barrier blocking moisture from moving through the wall, maybe to dry to the inside. And the reason that's not a good thing is because the moisture gets trapped, where otherwise it might dry and be fine. Uh, and where the, mo where the mold can grow is just in the glues of the wallpaper itself. So we, there's a long history of this. You could probably look online and in a search engine and find a lot of examples. And even if you go to images, look for pictures of mold behind wallpaper. So taking down wallpaper is something that needs to be approached <clears throat> with caution, especially if it's exterior walls and especially if they're masonry exterior walls, brick. Uh, but any exterior wall, I'd be extremely cautious about removing wallpaper because there can be mold growing behind the wallpaper itself in the glues. Mold on the wallpaper itself is, is possible to potentially wash off but then there's the question of why is there mold there to begin with? And usually that's a humidity issue and a sign that there's a bigger problem somewhere nearby. So my tips for, for, for wallpaper are pay attention to if it's on an exterior wall. Never use wallpaper on an exterior wall. Um, I would never add it in a project. And even some of these paints that are very vapor proof can be a problem on exterior walls. So, um, and be really cautious if you're ever removing wallpaper or cleaning a space and part of that cleaning is going to be removing wallpaper. Wear a lot of protection and be prepared. So masks, Tyvek suit, gloves, the whole thing, a lot of ventilation. I have a lot of other videos I've talked about cleaning uh, for that. So, uh, but in terms of moving, removing mold on wallpaper, other than looking for the, the source, you can use generally a light deterg a detergent, again, as little water as possible, but be looking for a bigger source. So I hope that's helpful. Join me at avoidingmold.com. Check out my Facebook page, Cheryl Seco Architect, and I hope this is helpful. If you enjoyed this video, hit subscribe. For more free information on safe building, avoiding mold, and water damage, visit avoidingmold.com.